Ranger F-22 Raptor was first built in 1997, and it cost a whopping $335 million to produce. At the time, the powerful jet was something out of the future. It combined super cruise functionality, super maneuverability and sensor fusion in a single weapon system. The US Air Force awarded Lockheed Martin $10.9 billion contract to upgrade the fighter jet, according to Defense News. In this video, first we're gonna review the F-22 specs, then we will talk about the upgrade. So let's get started. The F-22 was also designed to be incredibly stealthy, with wings that align perfectly with its horizontal stabilizer, helping to reduce its radar signature. It was engineered to have decreased radio emissions, infrared signature, acoustic signature and be less visible to the naked eye. This made it far superior to conventional jets. It was also equipped with an integrated avionics system that combined sensor fusion, data from the radar and other external sensors to enhance pilots' situational awareness. A fair amount of time has passed since its initial design. However, the jet isn't as unparalleled as it used to be. That's why an upgrade is at issue. Lieutenant Jen Clinton, Air Force Deputy Chief on Staff of Strategy, Integration and Requirements, said in a main interview with the Defense News that the enhanced Raptors, which in 2030 will be 40 years old, will simply serve as a bridge until the next generation air dominance program is ready to go. It's not just going to be the right tool for the job, especially when we're talking about defending our friends like Taiwan and Japan and the Philippines against the Chinese threat that grows and grows. The deal will be called the Advanced Raptor Enhancement and Sustainment Program Ares, and will take into account up to decades worth of sustainment and modernization of the fighter jet that will include upgrades, enhancements and other fixes as well as logistic services and modernization hardware kit procurement. What upgrades Lockheed would integrate into the F-22 are not known for sure. However, improvements to the Raptor's stealth coating could be expected, as could digital interference upgrades. The work is expected to take a decade to fully implement, if all options are utilized. The Department of Defense expects work to be finished by 2031. The United States Air Force is the world's sole F-22 operator and operates a fleet of 186 Raptors. However, thanks to the so-called Obey Amendment made to 1998 Department of Defense Appropriations Act, the United States government banned the F-22 from export. The export ban combined with the end of the Cold War hostiles following the collapse of the Soviet Union drastically reduced F-22 Raptor production to less than 200 from an anticipated 750. So, this was all the info at hand right now, but there are many many more questions unanswered. Like on the contrary of what the US claims, F-22 can be traced by China or Iran. Both have evidence and claim that they have tracked the famous stealth fighter. Maybe the new upgrade has something to do with the SLS problems? We just have to wait for the upgrade's release for these answers. Thank you all for watching, I hope you enjoyed the video. And don't forget to subscribe and stay tuned for the next video.